Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Aquarius. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is for the week of January 4th through January 10th. Keep in mind that the timing is still fluid and not every reading is for you. So what do we have for Aquarius for the week ahead? One card for an overall energy, please. The Emperor, you could be dealing with a Taurus. I believe that Taurus got this as well. Could also be dealing with an Aries or a Capricorn. Um, I feel as though you're going to need to take control, um, be your own boss, uh, take the lead, take charge of a situation. You may have to make a decision, okay? Maybe it's a, you know, this is a very decisive energy. You have to make some sort of decision. You may be needing to protect, maybe need to protect yourself, maybe need to protect your family. Um, you need to use your head, okay? Um, this is making a decision based on some sort of truth, I believe, based on the facts, based on, you know, how it's going to affect everybody involved, you know, being the uh, provider. You may be in a position of being the provider and you need to protect your family, protect your, your environment. Um, now the emperor is battle ready, ready to fight. So you may you may need to be ready to fight, ready to protect. Okay, so it's a very protective energy here. Um, you may be in protection mode. You know you need to protect. You feel the need to protect. Um, this is about uh, being in control, take control, taking control of your environment, taking control of a situation this week. Um, being the boss, making a, a very prominent decision by the looks of things. All right. You may be wanting to protect something. You may need to protect something. I think I've already said that enough. Um in protection mode by the looks of things. Tankard, celebration, fun, enjoyment. Rainbow, the most difficult part of a situation is over. Pin, new job or career. So, you guys may be getting in a position of authority this is the boss okay the emperor is the boss uh the, the ruler the dictator the person that makes the decision so you are going to be in a decision making role this week um, you may be getting a new offer that that puts you in a leadership leadership position if you have been in a difficult situation it is over the most difficult part of a situation is over you're in control you're the boss i feel as though uh whoever is up against you knows that you are the boss they know they know that you're the boss I do think that you have something to celebrate this week, so you're going to be getting, I think you're going to be getting some good news that causes you, you know, the desire to celebrate, okay? So you're going to be getting some good news by the looks of things. Four of Swords, now this is the end of a situation. It is definitely the end. This is the end of a situation where, you know, you may, may have uh, been exhausted, tired, fed up overwhelmed you may have reached the end you know you may have been hurting you may have been suffering but that's over I feel like it is definitely over I feel like uh, now you're regaining control you're regaining the position that you are meant to be in um, three of wands get prepared for an arrival get prepared for something something you have been waiting for is arriving the time is now Okay, you're in control. You're going to get what you want by the looks of things. You've been waiting for this. Here it is. Um, whatever it is that you, you've been probably thinking it was never going to come, it's time. It's definitely time. Um, hmm.
I think you weren't getting what you deserved. You may have been getting crumbs. You, you, there may have been a lack of reciprocation. There may have been some one-sidedness. There's been some sort of delay. Uh, you may have been waiting for some sort of offer or you've been waiting for somebody to give you something and they weren't moving very fast. You know, they were going very, very slow. There could have been some fear in the way or there could have been some um, strife or arguing or something like that or there may have been an injustice. Um, but, I, but it's definitely over. Okay, it's over. If things have been delayed and you weren't getting what you thought you were going to get, it's over. You're about to get something that you have been waiting for. Um, all is not as it seems. There are some hidden forces here. And there's been some sort of deception. You're not seeing something clearly. Queen of Cups, you could be dealing with a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Somebody's been hiding their feelings. This is hiding feelings, seriously. Somebody's been hiding their feelings. This is getting prepared. Somebody's been fearful, not giving anything. Definitely fearful, fearful of the unknown. Something may have ended. You may be intimidating to this person. We may also have a masculine here. I say you're the woman watching this or the feminine watching this, the feminine energy. You may have a masculine that is um, that you have taken a break from. You know, there's been some sort of ending. This person hasn't been moving. You know, they've been stagnant. They haven't been giving anything. Maybe they've been getting prepared. They've been hiding something. It's been below the surface. They've been fearful of the unknown about expressing their feelings. That could be coming for some of you. Um, you could also be, this could be, there could be somebody from the past here. The moon is the card of, uh, is a card of the past that is going to be expressing feelings this week. Okay, so just... You know, they've been getting prepared. So even if you're not looking for it, even if you're, there's, there, there could be somebody from the past that is, is expressing feelings this week. Okay. Um, now, I know a lot of you don't want that. I'm just saying that could happen even, even if you don't want it. Even if you don't want that to happen, there could be somebody from the past that is expressing feelings this week. Okay. This person may be feeling empty and lost inside. And, you know, they, they, uh, they may want to communicate with you. My advice is don't don't shoot them. <laughs> you know, don't, don't give them a chance. Just listen. Just listen to what they have to say. Okay. So somebody may want to say something to you, and you know, you may be you may have your guard up. You know, and they may be very fearful. I think they're intimidated by you. So there is somebody that is intimidated by you. They're intimidated by your poise. They're intimidated by your by your you know uh, dominance. You know, you're very dominant here. So I feel like there's definitely somebody that is fearful of you that is hiding their feelings and they're going to be expressing those feelings this week. That's for some of you. Um, if you are the masculine watching this, you're in charge, you're the boss, this is the end of a difficult situation, you're going down a new path, there is unknown. There's a lot of unknown here, but this is hoping for the best. So I feel like you are, you're facing your fears if you're the masculine energy. We have a masculine energy that is facing their fears. Okay, they are. They're 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 stepping into unknown territory and hoping for the best. They may be falling in love. Okay, there could be a love connection here where you know there's there's some sort of um, you know following of the heart. You know, um, and I said use your head here, but this is heart. So I think that there's definitely some feelings here for a feminine that are. Um, Genuine. I think that they're genuine. But let's see what else we got here. Ooh, there's another woman. There is another woman or another man. There's another person here. There's there's definitely fear. There's fear. There's uh lack of confidence. There's somebody here that lacks confidence, they lack self esteem. And they're fearful. They're very, very fearful. They're fearful of rejection. There's fear. There is somebody here that has been rejected. That is uh, hiding something. This person is hiding something. 
They have not made an entrance because they're fearful of being rejected. Absolutely. Um, I feel as though you are in a position of authority. I think that you are um, in control. You're going to have to make a decision this week. You're going to have to make a decision because somebody, I feel like there's somebody that um, is arriving. This person is going to arrive or, or something like that. Mm. Eight of Wands reversed. So there's been some sort of blocking of emotions. There's blocking emotions. Jealousy. You may have somebody here that is jealous. They're jealous of your position. You're in a strong position. You're in a very strong position. Somebody may be trying to stop you from moving in a new direction. You know, and they're jealous. And so they start communicating again. There's somebody also that is feeling guilty. They may be feeling they may be feeling guilty for lying or for whatever they did. And I feel like they're feeling guilty because you're the, of the position that you're in now. I think you're in a very strong position. And so I I feel like there's somebody that has been below the surface, you know. They've been uh not communicating, but they're definitely going to communicate this week. Um I don't know if you've blocked this person in the past or something like that, or they blocked you. They could be, you know, um, taking a chance and hoping, hoping for another chance, hoping for the best. So I, I do believe that you're going to, somebody's going to be expressing their feelings to you. And you may be feeling like, um, you may even feel standoffish. You may feel like, you know, you don't trust this person. Whoever you're dealing with is very forceful. They may be very needy. They may be very jealous. You could be dealing with somebody that is manipulative, that has lied to you in the past. Okay, this person is untrustworthy. They didn't give you, you know, what you what you thought, you know, when you met them. You know, they, they weren't all they were cracked up to be. You know, I feel like this person uh, is really in their feelings. They're in their feelings about the connection with you. And I feel like they're going to be trying. I feel like they're going to try to communicate with you uh, in some way. Could be dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. A water sign, Pisces in particular. Pisces uh, could be a Cancer or a Scorpio. We also we also have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But I really feel like Pisces is is uh, prominent here. Um, but it could be anybody. Um, could be an Aries. I think I said that. Could be an Aries. Could be a Capricorn. Um, you could also be dealing with somebody that is hiding something. This person is hiding something. It could be you could be dealing with somebody right now that is hiding something. It could be a third party with the three of wands. You could be dealing with somebody that is very needy. This person is clingy. They're needy. They're melodramatic. They're hiding something, and that's why they really haven't been giving you much. You may you may um, you may see something that maybe they're hiding messages. You know, with a water sign or something like that. They're hiding messages. You you could see these messages. Okay, you may you may see something, all right, that reveals something that has been hidden. That could happen this week. Um, hmm. Three of Swords. So this is painful. So the Three of Swords is pain. It's heartache. It's grieving over a loss, a separation. Somebody's grieving. Somebody is grieving over a loss. They have not been communicating. Okay, they have not been communicating. Um, because of fear, definitely because of fear, 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 no communication because of fear, uh, but they're hurting. So there is somebody here that is really, really hurting and they know that you're in control. They know that you don't play games. They know that you're not going to play games. So I feel like we have somebody here that is very, very, very much suffering. They're suffering over your decision that you have made. I feel like you've made a very huge decision. I feel like you've decided not to uh, focus on this person anymore. And because you have it, you've stopped focusing on this person. Now they're going to show up, you know, now they're going to show up. You're going to have to make a decision.
Knight of Pentacles. Or somebody dropped out. They dropped out or they didn't put in effort. They were lazy. You know, they were irresponsible or unfaithful. There's a lot of jealousy here. This is like an ex. I feel like you have an ex here that may try to stop you from doing something. They may try to cause some problems. Okay? This is trying to stop, trying to delay, trying to stop you. You know, they're jealous. They're jealous of your happiness. Right? Somebody may try to force something. You know, because the Queen of Wands in reverse is somebody that is very forceful. They're hurting. They're in pain. So they're going to try to delay. They're going to try to delay you. I feel like they're going to try to delay your happiness. Um, Knight of Pentacles reversed. There's an obsession here. You may have somebody that is obsessed. You may. You may have somebody that is obsessed with you. But they've been hiding it. Whoever you're dealing with doesn't appear to be qualified. They don't be, appear to be qualified, but and they're hurting. You know, they didn't put in effort. They're lazy. This person is lazy. They may have emotional outbursts. You know, this is an emotional and this is an about outburst. The moon next to the Queen of Wands may have somebody that is very dramatic. You know, this is somebody who is full of drama. It's probably going to cause some drama. So there could be some drama this week that puts you on guard. Okay, you could be having somebody from your past that is causing drama and you, you know, put your guard up. All right. Um, hmm. King of Pentacles reverse Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have that. We have strong earth energy here now as well. Now the King of Pentacles reverse is unstable, insecure. Um not really interested in a relationship, interested in financial security, you know, so I do, I do feel like, you know, you may, you may not be wanting to invest in this person. This person is very shallow, very superficial, um, very, very lazy and unstable. They may be looking for financial security, you know, that's why they're expressing their feelings. I do feel like they have some sort of feelings for you, but they're really unstable, okay? They're 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 not grounded, okay? They're obsessed. There's they're you're dealing with somebody who is not being realistic. They're not realistic, they're not practical, they're not responsible, they don't accept responsibility. So whether this is work related or, or relationship related, I feel like you're going to need to make a decision as to whether you want to work with somebody or not. There is somebody here that is very lazy and not qualified. This person is melodramatic. You may need to drop them. You, somebody, you may need to let somebody go if it's work related. Um, I do think it's going to be an emotional time with the moon card and the queen of cups. I feel like you're going to be in your emotions and you're going to need to use your head. Do not let your emotions get the best of you. Okay. You're probably going to be dealing with somebody this week that is in some sort of pain and they may be in pain over a relationship that hasn't worked out, you know, and you're the boss, you know, and they're taking it out on you. So I don't know if that's the case. Um, mm hmm. We also have somebody here that may have experienced some sort of separation and and now they're really, really upset. Okay, this is a separation. This is very, very upset, you know, and they're looking for some sort of emotional support. So, you know, because they're really, really, because they've experienced a separation, they're looking for emotional support. They've blocked you in the past. Now they want your support, okay? So just, just beware of that. Um, we have somebody here that is very, very materialistic. Okay, they're very, very materialistic. They want to have all the finer things in life, but it feels like they're lazy. If, if you would just give it to them, that would be great. All is not as it seems. There's an unclear and difficult path ahead because you've got somebody that is hiding something. And 
I feel like this person is in their emotions. They are unstable. They're insecure. They haven't been telling you something. And I feel like they're gonna, it's going to be expressed. I feel like it's going to be expressed this week. I do. Even though the Eight of Wands is reversed, this is like bad news. You may see it as bad news. I feel like whoever you're dealing with is trying to stop you. They're trying to stop you from moving on, whatever that means to you. They're trying to stop you. Three of Pentacles, trying to work together, communicate, cooperate. Somebody wants to communicate with you. They do. Hmm. Queen of Pentacles. You have a lot of Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn here. A lot of Earth energy. So this is about loyalty. Looking for something solid. Looking for something long term. We have somebody here that is very, very valuable. Now somebody realizes that. They realize another person's value. Now there could be somebody from the past that is also, I mean, if this, this could have to do with a partner, okay? There's somebody from the past, I know that there is, that is, that is communicating. They are going to be communicating, whether it's with you or your partner. They're looking for something stable. They're looking for something long-term. I do feel like there's a third party here. I do feel like there's a third party here. There's been some sort of blockage. Somebody's been blocking their feelings, hiding them, pushing them down, but they can't do it anymore. Get ready to fight. That's the main message for the emperor. Get ready to fight. Get ready. Get ready for a battle with whoever this third party is. Good luck.